So welcome to the shortwave radio channel. I've reorganized a little bit my um, setup for amateur radio here uh, since I have purchased a new mini PC that actually will be doing its first live show on Saturday, January the 4th. Um, I, of course, have relocated the PC that I was using, and it will be my main PC controlling my Yisu FTDX10. So all the software for digital modes will be there, including all amateur software that I need. And of course, I've got this 24 inch monitor here, which is great. I can, of course, change from this screen, and if I want, I could go and display the uh, Yesu's own screen on it too. So this is the old mini PC that I've uh, been using for live shows. This is an Intel 8th generation Core i5. And it worked great. It's got Windows 11 on it. And it is still a very good PC. It's just getting a little older. So uh, I've uh, installed FLDG, MMSS TV for slow scan television. Of course, FT8 or WSJTX to do some FT8. And uh, this will actually encourage me in making a lot more digital modes because I've been pretty much, you know, staying away from most modes because I was not really installed well. And the PC I had been using is a very old PC. I wanted to have something a little better. So this is going to be my new setup for my amateur radio gear. It's cool because it's a small PC, just, you know, uh, lies there, a little black box not taking a lot of space so all of that and of course the fact that it's uh linked to my um, yesu ftdx 10 will uh, have you know an impact i'll be doing a lot more stuff so uh, this is going to be what's uh, happening so right now i was just monitoring 14230 it was one of my first things i want to go back to i haven't done it in a while go back to trying some uh uh, slow scan television contacts. I had made quite a few back in uh, about you know six seven months ago, but uh, I wanted to uh, dabble again uh, into that. And of course, I've installed FLDG, which means I have all sorts of other digital modes that I can dabble on. Uh, for example, here if I I go to uh, let's say I'm going to remove this. Wait, there's another picture coming in. Let's check it out. Oop. Guy's transmitter went off just as it started. So uh, I can, of course, go to FLDG. And if I have other modes, for example, I don't know if Boston is there right now. We're going to check it out here. Yeah, here we go. So this is... And this is a uh, weather fax. So let's go here in the option menu. We fax. There we go. The, blade, the lines are matching perfectly. So technically in a few seconds we'll see a weather chart start showing up. I just see here on the display at the top. We let it decode. So it's as you see, it's ready now to to decode. Uh, the only thing I've got left for the Yesu is uh, for FLDG to put all the details of the radio to control it, the radio itself. So FLDG does still needs that. Uh, I've done it with MMSSTV, put all the parameters for the control to the uh, the uh, Yesu, and of course uh, for FT8 also. But uh, I think it's a good move, and I think it's going to be a lot more interesting to have this PC here uh, as it's more powerful to uh, do all sorts of things, and including, of course, the coding digital modes. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thanks for watching.